In this video, I want to talk about setting aside communication-free time. What I mean by that is it might be 60 to 90 minutes where you're not using your phone. You make it sort of a rule. You're not using a phone, no meetings, and uh, no email. So those are all methods of communication. We should probably add like, you know, text messaging, calls, meetings, email. There should be some time where it makes sense to just be alone and not communicating besides with that inner voice in your head. And if you have that, it makes it a lot easier to focus on your project. So make sure that you set aside that communication free time. When is that gonna be? It's gonna differ for everybody. But if you can do that as a part of your day and how much time you dedicate depends on the kind of work you do. But if you can set aside some of that communication free time, you're gonna find yourself much more productive. There's a lot of people that are overloaded with too much communication during the day and as a result, they don't get things done or they don't get enough things done because there's constant meetings, constant phone calls. Now we got email, I got text messages, all sorts of communication back and forth. There should be a slot where, for me, it might be anywhere from 60 to 90 minutes. It could be at the beginning of the day, middle of the day, end of day, but it's important to have that time to yourself to work on maybe that big project that you've been putting off. So make sure you're setting aside communication-free time.